Ninja Masters, How Ninpo Cho, is a ninja-themed 2D fighting game produced by ADK and originally released in 1996 for the Neo Geo Arcade and Home platform. Ninja Masters was the sixth and final fighting game produced by ADK, following the four games in the World Heroes series and Aggressors of Dark Combat. It was later featured in the 2008 compilation ADK Dimashu for the PlayStation 2. Ninja Masters was also re-released on the Neo Geo X handheld system in 2012, and for the virtual console in 2013. In 2019 it was released as part of arcade archives developed by Japanese company Hamster. As of 2021, Ninja Masters was released worldwide on Nintendo Switch and Xbox One. The PS4 version remains exclusive to Asia but includes both Japanese and English releases. Gameplay screenshot showcasing a match between Sasuke Sarutobi and Tenho. Ninja Masters follows the conventions of many previous 2D fighting games released for the Neo Geo. The player must defeat their opponent in combat in a series of best 2 out of 3 matches. Characters can change between using the character's weapon or fight hand-to-hand -hand during the middle of combat. Like the Art of Fighting series, Ninja Masters features a super meter. Like various ADK games, SNK Playmore also revived characters from Ninja Masters in later releases. The main character of Ninja Masters, Sasuke, appears as an SNK character card in SNK vs. Capcom, Card Fighters DS. Reception in Japan, Game Machine listed Ninja Masters on their July 1, 1996 issue as being the 14th most popular arcade game at the time. The game received generally positive reception from critics since its release in arcades and other platforms. In a retrospective review of the Neo Geo Ice version, all games Kyle Knight called it a fairly good fighter that could have been a lot more. Covering the Neo Geo Ice version, the four reviewers of Electronic Gaming Monthly offered some praise for the game's special moves and the ability to fight with or without a weapon. But generally panned Ninja Masters for its failure to distinguish itself from the many previous Neo Geo fighting games and for its outdated graphics, particularly the small character sprites and lack of scaling. Sean Smith and Ken Williams remark that the game's mediocrity is shocking given SNK's history, and the $150 price tag. In contrast, a next-generation critic found originality to be the game's biggest asset, opining that although Ninja Masters lacks the balance and smoothness of the best Neo Geo fighting games, the ability to switch between weapons and bare-handed combat in mid-fight adds dramatically to the strategy. Consoles Plus's Maxime Rohr commended the detailed sprites fluid animations, longevity and playability. Man. AC's Andreas Kau felt mixed in regards to the audiovisual presentation and Samurai Showdown-style character roster but criticized the jerky animations and lack of innovations. In contrast, Nintendo Life's Corby Dillard regarded Ninja Masters as one of the more unique fighting games released on Neo Geo stating due to the ability to change between two fighting styles, stating that at times it feels like a combination of Samurai Showdown and King of Fighters rolled into one game. Ken Pyle of Mancy Games praised the feudal Japan atmosphere, fast gameplay and responsive controls but felt mixed in regards to the character roster and criticized the audio design. Thanks for watching.